Extreme health healthy. STS at Ron Cohn E Day in a computers dot com or video parity oi STS at Ron. So another video for you today. Let me cut to the chase, but let me uh, check something really quick. Another video for you. All right. I have a Dell Latitude E fifty five thirty. I want to sell it so I want to sell it so I want to remove any positive hold on a second let me I have a new setup here so I have to all right I have a Dell Latitude E5530 I want to sell it so I want to remove any possible way it links to me all right whatever how do I factory reset it or what do you recommend I do? So with micro crap, micro shit, micro slop, wind blows, 10 operating system, there's a feature called reset this PC and that's basically the answer. So this is a factory reset. This isn't a proverbial factory reset video where you have to jank around hitting the fucking, I don't know, Dells are different. You know, the zero key, the F8, the special menu, the F12 at boot. Now, this is if the laptop has Windows, Microsoft Windows 10 and it most likely does because this is a newer laptop and all you do is perform a reset this PC so I will go ahead that's the answer that's the short answer you can leave now you probably already have now let me give you the instructions on how to perform a reset this PC now there's two options with a reset this PC it has to have Windows 10 already installed. You have to be able to log into it and access the desktop. The f so be aware when you perform these tasks with, you know, micro crap, micro ship, micro slop, Windows operating system. So you have two choices. One is going to wipe everything. And then that is the answer to this question. You're going to perform a reset this PC. You're going to use the option that wipes everything all of your personal data so back it up if you need to and also your programs get removed and then it's going to reinstall windows 10 i think it reset this pc i think it resets it back to when it was originally installed but don't quote me on that because because of the updates they have major updates every six months so don't quote me on that but it it, it removes everything it removes all the programs it removes all your personal data. It removes everything that's traceable, trackable, logs, blah, blah, blah. It just reinstalls Windows 10 back, I think, to the the last time it, it was installed or when it was installed. So in order to perform or reset this PC, what you do is... On Windows 10, you, you can use Cortana or you can left click the Windows 10 icon and then type into Cortana. Oh, well, here's another way to do it. You can use Cortana, the search, just go to the search tool. It's the, it's a circle or it's all, you can change that to just have a circle icon. The, the icon for a Cortana search is actually just the little globe. It's just a round circle. Click on that, type in reset this PC. It should search and find it, select it. Or another way you can get to reset this PC is you would click on the settings gear icon, then choose update and security. So you go into update and security, then choose recovery. Then you're going to select reset this PC and then you're gonna click on get started and choose an option I have I have better instructions than that but in my blog post click on the link in the description box below that'll take you to my website <laughs> ain't it computers dot com I don't watch television much but I changed motels or hotels and I just happen to have the TV on cuz of my activism and I was gonna yeah, there was a shooting 
at a military base and I was going to cover that and oh oh wait YouTube censored me off my activism channel because I used to talk about subjects like that anyways I had the TV on and just television is so fucking stupid the movies are fucking stupid it just anyways I have these other instructions let me go over I don't want to make this video too long so that that's the answer right there if you want to reinstall Windows 10 quote unquote factory reset it's basically it, it really to to me is like a factory reset it's supposed to reinstall Windows 10 back to when you first used it you bought the brand new Dell E5530 used it for a while your pornography your AshleyMadison.com or whatever the goddamn you Americans get into well if you want to reset let's say you want to sell the computer or you want to give it to, away to your daughter or your son or I don't know whoever your wife I mean your mistress I mean well isn't that what you Americans perpetrate you fucking cheat on each other all day the divorce rate is way over 50 percent <laughs> you know anyways you just don't want any traces that you've used the laptop so reset this PC it's a, it's a different way in my opinion well it really depends on Dell has a pretty good you know factory reset but it doesn't always work and reset this PC is pretty decent actually and I usually don't give Microsoft that many you know positive vibes I need to quit looking at that dumb shit television alright let me see how long I, I haven't been. Let, me look at, let me look at my encoder and alright I'm at the six minute mark seven minute mark that's not bad there's another option so I this is overtime I already gave you the answer if you want to restore it to factory you can perform a reset this PC and I already gave you the instructions however I will have written instructions in text format and you would click on the link in the description box below that'll take you to my blog post at anacomputers.com so that you can peruse on your own accord in the abstract instructions on how to perform a reset this PC so that it'll wipe everything now remember with reset this PC you have two options so you need whenever you fuck around with computers you need to become aware especially like system restore and reset this PC you, you know what I'm saying I give you the instructions that will wipe everything so be aware of that now I will there's another option when you go through the reset this PC it'll ask you do you want to wipe everything or do you want to keep your personal data now bo both options removes all your programs so you need to become aware of that too it's not system restore a system restore keeps all your programs except for the most recent ones except for the ones that have been installed since you restored but it keeps everything else program wise reset this PC I don't know why it is it always removes all your programs now there is an option that it will keep your personal data so I don't know why Microsoft designs it that way that in my opinion they should have a third option where it would keep all your programs well but what you're doing is you're resetting the computer so I kinda understand that it's just a way to wipe and go back now quickly let me see I had better instructions I have two computers here oh shit wrong computer reset this PC this is overtime this is like bonus shit the second reset this PC yeah did I include it I should have maybe I did not I might if I get around to I haven't written the blog post yet I did I did search the keyword for this video and, I, and I'm live streaming I try to live stream now it saves me a lot of time I just live streaming I don't give a fuck if anybody shows up actually I don't want anybody to show up because I'll just get distracted so I don't give a shit if anybody shows up or not but when you live stream it automatically archives your videos it, it takes a while even these shorter videos yeah YouTube's kinda slow and I'm using MKV video what do they call it video whatever, whatever. that could be it but I don't get warnings about anyways you don't need to know that about that crap 
I don't have the other lengthier instructions. Let me let me look real quick. I thought I had the real lengthy ones where where I described where you have two choices. Well, you will have two options. One will allow you to keep all your personal data, but your applications will get removed. The section option will remove all your personal data and applications. Yeah, I, I guess I kind of included it, but. Oh, you can also type in system reset. I think if you go to a run box in Windows 10 and type in system reset, no spaces, all one word, system, and then, the you know, system reset. The two words combined, no spaces in between, no nothing like that. And then I think it'll open it up also. You do know that in Windows, here's a bonus tip. In, in with Microsoft for a long time, maybe all the way back to Windows 95, or I would say at least Windows 2000, maybe, I don't know, whatever. If you know the executable, you can actually open a run box and you can actually run the act, the act just type in the exact command that is the executable. You know what I'm saying? See, even Microsoft is dumbed down. It's very dumbed down. Well, click on the gear and then click on the gear icon and then click on update and security. Well, if you know the commands and there's a certain folder where they're all, they're all at and it just lists all of the .exe, all the executables. You can, I think you can even open up control panel if you know the exact executable. That could be in case the GUI fucks up Oh, Windows 10 is terrible. Windows 10 is garbage. Nothing's changed. An up, up to, any update could just take it out to the point where, oh yeah, quite often, you're the, the Windows 10 menu doesn't work or the desktop icon, icons don't work you, you, and then the Windows 10 doesn't, you can't open a run box, you can't open the search box, you're pretty much fucked. But if you know if you but you could there's another way to open up task manager and then you would click in there and then and then oh, then type it and then there has a run box in there and then you t <laughs> trust me I had to do that once before or I had to help somebody do it anything else about I think that's it man that that's one way that you can I don't have any other detailed instructions for reset this PC Ah, interesting. All right, this video is already lengthy enough. I'm getting close to 15 minute mark now. All right, so that is how you can perform a Dell. What is it? E. What is it? What is it? Dell Latitude E5530 Factory Restore. It's not technically using the Dell tool, but it is a way to factory restore it. And I gave you instructions on how to reset all of the personal data gets wiped, all of the applications gets wiped. In case you want to give it to your mistress, I mean your wife not faces of of your usage on the computer. Adios.